Oh, God, what's happening? That's where I've been the whole time. In the bathroom. Ugh. That didn't sound clean. Uh-uh. Well, I've, uh, spent some time off-screen, wasting time, getting a couple items we'll need for this particular episode. And we are now going to go meet up with Isabella. That was the one promise we made after we tackled her to the ground. And you're about to break it! Come on, dude! I'm going. I'm going. And that's something I was actually afraid of because we're getting close. It starts at midnight. Ooh. Eh. Or, or not exactly starts. It. The time that you need to be there is between 12 and 1. So you have an right. hour of like extra time that you can rush all the way here. But really, five minutes. Yeah, it's about five minutes game time. Or uh, real yeah. life time. Yeah. Oh, and I'm waiting for another call. Where is it? Uh... Hmm. There it is. Look at that. There's a group of freaks in the movie land. Have you not noticed? I mean, there's freaks everywhere. <laughs> there's freaks in the stores. There's freaks walking out and everywhere. It's just yeah, everywhere freaks. Why is this? Why is this one group of freaks? Just, whatever. Only now does Otis realize. Wait a minute. There are raincoat guys everywhere. Oh, shit! I should probably pay attention to the monitors a bit more! Otis, you are such a useless human being. But at least he tells us about the uh, the big group of cultists. We can now take them out if we finish that mission. I thought they were wearing white hoods, but then I realized it was different. Flashbacks, man. Uh... This is a really short one. As soon as you go to the meeting place, Frank looks like he's been there for hours... Uh, check the watch. Jeez, oh, where is she? Maybe it's the hat. Mm, maybe. That's a lady repellent right there. <gasps> oh, uh oh, oh no! So she can take down Frank in like three hits, but when it comes to one lone zombie, she's helpless. God yep, damn girl. Come on. Uh, Were you bitten? No. It was Carlito. I tried to talk him into coming, but it was no good. He, he doesn't trust anyone. He shot you? He didn't mean to. He was upset. Uh, uh, I don't know what he'll do next. Uh, uh. Hey. Uh. Hey. Yeah, Frank can uh, look around all these uh, big, heavy guys who are, like, disabled, but, you know, Isabel... <laughs> Alright, guess what? Escort mission time. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is the one... I believe it's the one lone escort mission story-wise, because there's escort missions everywhere. But this one is very important. If Isabella dies, you lose the game. <laughs> and on the way, there is a secret survivor just standing outside your meeting place... I hate this guy. I'm Kindel. I like shotguns. Ha! ha! I I seriously hate the survivor. He is an asshole, and he's got a shotgun. That's the first problem. That he doesn't know how to use, apparently. Oh, wait. Oh! Give it Except a second. until the last minute. L let me tell you, Kindel really knows how to use that shotgun. How well does he know how to use it? If there's a zombie in front of you, he'll try to shoot it and shoot you in the process. Kindle has no control over where... He does have control over where he shoots. If he sees a zombie, he's going to shoot it. But if anybody's in front of that zombie, you're getting shot, too. Well, the shotgun's a close-range weapon. You can only use it at its maximum efficiency when it's really right up close to your face. He also has a secondary mission where he can cause a mutiny later, and I hate him for that. But we so want him to join still, don't we? Yep, gotta save everybody. So my advice, if you find Kindle and you actually want to save him, trust me, you're probably going to be better off leaving him be, but give him something that's not a firearm. Come on. Yeah, how about if I take that shotgun away from you and I'm going to give you this bag of chips. Go nuts, kid. Go nuts. <laughs> one positive thing I can say about Kindle, there is one lone thing. 
he will just run through hordes. He won't stop to kill every single one, he'll just run through them. Well, he's got a battle axe now, I mean... CHARGE! But the thing is, I was expecting every time we ran through a horde, because they won't attack me, because I've got somebody on my back, but they'll immediately go for Kindle, but I gave him something to defend himself, I was hoping, you know, maybe if I run fast enough he'll just run straight through, and he does. Hmm. One of the lone survivors that's actually a little smart. Well, give him credit, he's survived this long. <laughs> and he hasn't, he hasn't got caught by a horde, he's actually killed more zombies than have attacked him. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, several playthroughs, Frank hasn't made it this far, even. <laughs> playthroughs of mine, at least. I don't know what that means. Yeah. Or whatever. That was dumb. <laughs> 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 uh. <laughs> Just start spitting out zombie dust. <laughs> oh, God, it's uh, I got bee, I got bee on my face! Uh. Uh. Did they come through? Yes, they did. Oh. Good. I don't know- I don't know why you're carrying me, Frank. I mean, my arm is shot, not my legs. This little path here, where you can go left or right, it's the kiss of death if you go to the right, so please go here where you're not close to the water. What's the kiss of death? The kiss of death, as I would describe it, is making a very grave mistake on something so simple. Mm. And, uh, this is where Kindle really pisses me off. I just wanted is to wait for him to get back. Is, is he gonna try and kill Isabella? Oops. I accidentally wait, wait. gave him my- Oh, no. Oh, no, oh, no, Take no, it back. No, no. Give the- oh. ah! Okay. Well, I managed to get my chainsaw back from him. Oh my ah. god. And I lost a chunk <laughs> of my shoulder. I'm sorry, Is Oh ah! god! What's happening? Oh lord, my back! Oh, Kendall's an animal! <laughs> it can't be stopped! He's doing his job, but he's doing it wrong! He looks like some kind of secret agent guy, like <laughs> secret service nonsense. He does, he's got a not got a nice suit on, he's got a battle axe, he's covered he, in he's blood right now. He's seen this shit before, he's lived through this before, <laughs> man. Man, I've seen it all the time. He's not black. I thought he was. No, he's not. Look at him. Oh, Is he? I, I think so, I just can't see. I don't think, well, I don't think he is. He's I dark. Tell. Well, whatever. Yeah. Uh, hey, that's not nice. It doesn't really matter. Oh, okay. no, you actually went there. That's, I uh, did go. Anyway, we are home free. I hope. Are are we? I hope. Are we? I really hope. Where's Kendall? I'm trying not to cry. <laughs> Kendall! <laughs> oh my god. I hate Kendall so much. What is he doing back there? Getting caught. This is like the worst place to transport survivors. I think they intentionally put it this zigzag, <laughs> whatever nonsense, it, right yeah. before the entrance. So yeah, that way they can just much. piss you off so many times. Oh, and it happens every single time. Yeah, I, I don't know why I have a personal hatred for Kindle. It's probably because of his attitude as a survivor. Like, his AI is pretty good, but the stuff he does later really makes me mad. How does the elevator always consistently fill up with zombies every single time you come out here. I mean, look, it's filled up with zombies again. Hmm. Maybe every time you cut off a zombie head, it's, it's like seeds on a tree. Isabella, is that you're doing? Who is that? Is she hurt? Yeah. You're looking at the bad guy's sister. Bad guy? The one who caused all this? That's right. Her asshole brother caused the zombie outbreak. His sister? What in the hell is going on here? I mean, does this have anything to do with that announcement earlier? I don't know much more than you at this point, okay? But he shot her, I can tell you that. And just so you know, that would be the same guy that shot you. What's he after? What's his ultimate goal? I don't know. But according to her, his plan isn't over. Not yet. Fine. Consider her in DHS custody. We'll question her when she wakes up.
Oh, he is black. Oh, God, his attitude sucks. He will fuck you, too. Yeah, yeah, go fuck yourself. All right, next one is at 3 a.m. We've got a little bit of time. A little bit. Very little. So you know what we're going to do in the meantime? Get our life up. Oh. Oh, so much more life. I Have love it. Have you no shame? Have you no shame? I was taking a picture of two ladies. You no shame. What's wrong with that? No shame. Shameless. No shame. Yeah, you're right. What's uh, next? Let's see. Next on the docket is actually something that a lot of people tend not to do and get screwed over later as a first-time player. I am going to tell you right now, since we have this free time in between missions, I'm going to go find the maintenance tunnel key. Ah. The maintenance tunnel key is a very interesting item in the fact that there are emergency exits, uh, sometimes multiple emergency exits, in every single giant section of the mall. And the only reason you would want the maintenance tunnel key is if you accidentally get lost in the maintenance tunnel... For whatever reason, you'll see why later, but you can find your way out into a different part of the mall where it's not as dangerous. I actually forgot where the maintenance key was, I think. I have an easy solution for you, so that nobody will ever forget again. Well, alright. Let's do that thing we're doing now. And then we are heading straight there. The easiest place to enter the maintenance tunnel is actually from outside where the car and motorcycle are. That's the direct opening to the tunnels, isn't it? Mm-hmm. This will make it very simplistic. And those zombie fucking psychopaths are still out there. Convicts. Yeah, they are. I can't wait till they're gone. Because you can't kill true anarchy, man. I guess you could say anarchy reigns. It's not raining. R E I G N S. Rigs? What the hell? Rains. The English I'm... language is weird. Yeah, it is. Oh, uh, did you happen to notice the convicts were missing as we were transporting Isabella? Yeah, now that I think about it, this is the first time I'm hearing the. Oh, it's because of Kindle. <laughs> it's like, yeah, alright, see, we got. Oh, shit, it's Kindle! He's Get the fuck Kindle. out of shit! Oh, man! I haven't seen him in forever, and I never wanted to see him again. Drive, man. That, that motherfucker's crazy. <laughs> yeah, he's the insane one. Is that motherfucker got a battle axe? Oh, shit, we're definitely out of here. <laughs> Where's that shotgun he had? I bet he'd left it with his other ten victims. Shit, man. Why, Kendall? Is he gone? Yeah, it's Frank. All right, let's go. Yeah, all right, let's go get him. Right. We still killing zombies? Yeah, well, you got nothing better to do. That guy's got a one-track mind, I'll tell you what. Could go inside, I mean, it's not that bad. <laughs> yeah, James, I'm kind of cold. Just shut the fuck up! Alright, if you want the easiest way to find the maintenance tunnel key, come in through here and turn right, and then at the first left, turn left. Uh-huh. And then at the next right, you uh -huh. turn right. Uh-huh. And head all the way back here, and in that room right there is the maintenance tunnel key. You lost me. Well, I'm sorry, you're going to have to go back and watch the video again. Okay, let me just uh, rewind here and... Uh... Okay, I got it. Oh, now you're like a minute behind. Shit! Uh, this particular area is also important uh, later on in the main story, but for now, we have access to the entire maintenance tunnel through the emergency exits. I wonder why they would leave a key right there. Interns? I guess. I put it here so I won't forget it. Wait, I forgot where it was now, because I don't know where to go now. God, you're such a new person! Eh. I've only worked here a week! <laughs> and it's a long weekend! Ah! Spring break! Oh, f Here's the one request I wanted. Fucking Floyd. <laughs> Uh-oh, car broke. He wants us to wine and dine him now, it seems. Yes. You have so much time to do this one, but I'm running out of time for the next story mission, so I'm just going to head back there and give him what he wants. You have, you have, you have so much time you can brew your own wine and give it to him. And, 
<laughs> so much so. I think his lasts until noon of this day. So he got 12 in-game hours to do this. It's 12.01, here's your wine. Uh, it's too late for wine now. <clears throat> the only thing you need for this request is a bottle of wine. And you can find tons of those as soon as you walk into the food court. There's like 12, 15 bottles maybe just lying around. Yeah, there's like a couple of wine shops around, I think, too. There is uh. no... You should have no Whoa. problem finishing this mission. And wow, I just brained myself. You certainly did. Got a couple bees out of the deal, though. Good job. One thing, uh, another just kind of... Pro tip, MLG, pro strat for Dead Rising. 420 no scope. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was 360 no scope. For, well, whatever. 420 blazing it up no scope. Oh, yeah. You don't know real MLG skills. <laughs> Apparently not. But uh, grab as many bees as you can. Because on dawn of the third day, there will be even more zombies. Most of the time, you won't be able to walk just like in a straight line without running into like 50. But all the blood and gore. It's gonna be great. I, I wish I could just like find duct tape and duct tape too many chainsaws to Frank's arms and just spin around a lot. Just tie a whole bunch of chainsaws to his body, just have him roll around like some kind of death Katamari. And then he grows. That's so the Royal weird. Rainbow I would love to see. <laughs> Royal Rainbow of Death. Now oh, I kind of want to see that. A rolling pin of Frank West and Chainsaws. While uh, bright poppy J-pop music plays in the background. Alright, Floyd. I'm here for you. What do you want? Can I put my pants back on? I can actually see he's wearing pants now, so... There you go. Yeah. Oh, he's so, so long-winded. A little alcohol should soothe our nerves. Well, why don't you get some whiskey, then? All right. I about had a heart attack when I accidentally didn't have the wine equipped, and I oh. said no. Nice. But thankfully, he is very forgiving, and you just have to equip it and then talk to him again. Oh, so it's not like a matter... If you say you don't have any, it doesn't, like, automatically fail it for you? Right. Okay. <sighs> so it just All says, right. humph, well, I'll wait here until you do then. <sighs> Correct. All right, uh, so I had to go back and re-record everything just to get to that point where we started. And uh, Great this, job! Yeah, it's not going so well, but look how much time is on the clock. Oh, God. Now, look, she has one hit left. Girl uh, hunting season's almost over! Uh, wait, wait for it. Oh, uh, what happened what, first? It, what happened first? I don't know. Did you die, or did she die, or did, did it end, or what? 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 It ended. What? No! No! What? I killed you! Get back here! That's not fair! That was absolute bullshit. Yeah, it was! She was gone. That one hit offed her. She was dead. And the timer ran out. That's not fair. That is that is literally like a split second difference between the mission ending and her final death rattle. You know what? Fuck you. I'm going to let you die this time. How'd you know? <laughs> uh, here's what happens to Isabella when you don't immediately kill the zombie. Yeah. And now it is uh, preserved for, for pus... Prosperity's sake. Eh, prosperity's <laughs> sake. Can't fucking talk. Oh, what is he doing? With imagery like this, I wouldn't be able to talk either. Blech. Oh, come on. By the way, Kendall's outside shooting zombies. <laughs> and he didn't notice Isabel coming in like that? <laughs> Apparently not. He got there, like, right after. Whoa, shit. That lady's in trouble. Oh, well. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, well. Oh no, we we done did it. That done did it. Whoops. Okay. Uh, remember when I told you not to go to the right because there's water? Uh oh oh no. Oh, oh no. god. Oh no no. Oh, oh god. 
she fell in the water. This is a nightmare. Oh, oh, oh God. This is a nightmare. <laughs> oh, my God. What Isabella. The hell? I'm trying. I'm trying, Isabella. Come on. Let's get out. Oh, I can't. Of course. I can't get up that small ledge. Oh, she fell back in. Just somehow just fell back in. I can't give up this two inch high step. <laughs> I hurt so much. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's get you out of here. Uh, oh, Kendall, man. you go ahead and keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> you're damn right. <laughs> See, I. Th okay, he's he's coming with me. Okay. I was, oh, wait. Where is he? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, uh oh. Nope, he didn't follow me. Uh -uh. All right, so uh, let's try something else. Uh, Isabella, you stay right there and go ahead and defend yourself. Uh, Kindle is over here. He is absolutely hoarded. Look at all these zombies around him. How the fuck do you use this fucking battle axe? <laughs> oh, I accidentally chainsawed him. Like two more hits and he's dead. All right, come on. I just need to get him out. Oh, he's he fell in, in the, the water, water. Too. Oh lord, and he's trying to jump. He really is, but there's. Oh. Oh, oh of God! Course. No, of course. Isabella got torn apart. Well, that happens. Oh, shit. Hmm. That's a little bit of a tragic end. Well, uh, thanks so much for watching this Let's Play of Dead Rising. I hope you enjoyed it. It's not as easy as it looks, trust me.